people, it's Poet. And we are in the dinosaur world today. And as you can see, we are right where we left off, staring at the dinosaurs. Um, I was just looking for a shovel. Don't have one. So we will have to go get one. Now, there has been much talk about these two. Uh, some people think that they will despawn. Other people think that they will fight to the death. Other people yet think that if I go down there, eventually when they grow bigger, whoop, drowning, drowning, eventually they will eat me. <laughs> I don't know. I think I trust them. I think, I think they will continue to be nice to me. Just because. Just because. So, I'm going to make a shovel. I'm going to enchant that shovel a little bit. And we are going to maybe start work on the hotel today. Because that's something that I wanted to... Oh, something that I wanted to work on for quite some time. Um, and it's really just been sitting there staring me in the face for the longest time. So I'm going to work on that today. And also, I'm going to maybe see about digging out the rest of that Tyrannosaurus thingy, enclosure. Okay, let's see what we can get. Eight is good. Unbreaking. Pfft. Sucks. Should have enchanted it with a level one. Ugh. Just unbreaking one. Ugh. So bad. So bad. Alright, so let's go and dig up the... You know what? I didn't have to come all this way. What am I doing? I need to get some wood. I think... I'm going to use the spruce, because spruce just looks awesome with everything. And I've got still quite a bit of it left. Um, let's put that up. And this and that. Miscellaneous chest, I'm going to just throw some stuff in there. For now. Broken ancient helmet. Do I have... <gasps> let's make... Which one do I need? I forget. I'll take both. Let's see this archaeology workbench. Oh, good! There it is. I was going to make another one. Uh, why not? <laughs> Just have the two. Take that off. Put that on. Wicked looking. Just the best helmet ever. They should make a whole set of armor. Hey! Hey, you! Yeah, you! You watching who is developing the fossils and archaeology mod... Maybe you're on the development team. How about this? You see Anu's helmet, the Pigman Emperor. Give me his armor. I want his armor. I want a full set of Pigman Emperor armor. Do that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so apparently they are working on a a new what can I call it? It's just a new version of the dinosaur mod, which I'm sure a lot of you guys know about already. And uh, apparently it is like they have a new version out. They've been working on it pretty diligently. Um, work has been done. Work has been done. So I'm very anxious. I think, if I'm not mistaken, that a version was actually supposed to come out today. Like, they are that close to being done, so I am very, very, very excited about that. I was looking for it. I was hoping that I would be able to get a copy of it before I recorded tonight, but I guess not. Um, but that's okay. I mean, we can wait and look forward to doing that one. Um, hey, maybe they'll feature my Let's Play on their page. That would be very kind of them. <laughs> Okay, so let's see. I always mark off the corners, so let's do that. I mean, it's pretty obvious where the corner goes, but you never know. Okay, like this. I know that... The funny thing is that building in this world, some people really don't like it. They don't like when I build. How can you not like when I build? It's Minecraft. That is the point of the game. Not only that, but we are making this place look so much better. For our guests. So, this shovel, I wish I had an efficiency shovel, actually. I mean, Unbreaking will 
kind of, sort of help, but... Oh, an efficiency shovel would have been so much faster. Even efficiency one would have been that much faster. I guess I could have made a diamond shovel. I think I have some diamonds. Um, but I didn't, so... Too bad, so sad. We'll have to just work with what we got. Okay, already that looks better. Why didn't I at least do this before? Okay, so let's... How tall shall we make this building? Let's figure that out. Let's make it... Let's just make this a huge hotel. Like, let's make it this tall. Let's make it even taller. <laughs> How many floors should we have? Let's make it this tall. That is huge. How am I going to get down? I don't have my feather falling boots. Oh, what level are we on? We are on 90. Okay. Well, I'm going to heal myself as much as I can. Now that I'm trapped up here. And I'm going to jump. Maybe we'll die. I don't know. I guess we will see. Okay, almost healed. Come on. Come on. 90. Level 90. I guess I could go across in the meantime. Just do this. Because this is how big it's going to be. I really should have brought more uh, torches up here, but didn't really think ahead. Ugh. Okay, I think that's the last one, so... we. Oh my god, two and a half hearts left? Oh, that is high up, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> well, ouch. I won't be doing that very often. I'm going to have to build up to it now. Because I'm too terrified to, to do that otherwise. Okay, so... I started on the corner here because I was thinking of maybe cutting out the corners. I think I may still. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Just talking to myself, don't you worry. Okay, so when we're on the floor, that is going to be the top of it. Right? Top floor? Yeah, okay, but I don't want it that material. Okay, so let's talk to ourselves a little bit more. So have you ba can I talk? How have you guys been doing? You doing good? That's good. Just going to make the frame. That is a nice big door. I like that. I like that quite a bit. So we're just framing this place up. Right now, um, the floors material will be... What kind of material should I do? That is the question. I'm not really sure, actually, what I should do for the floors. Um, maybe a birch wood, because birch always looks really good, like you can see over there. Birch looks awesome with the spruce. It's like a cookies and cream. It just looks good. Cookies and cream are beautiful. That's all. Let me get around here. And did I just see a creeper? No. I'm I'm seeing things. I'm just paranoid that this thing is going to get destroyed somehow. Oh, I can't wait for that new version of the mod to come out. Um, it probably will fix quite a bit of the little glitches that we have. I can't wait until dinosaur riding is fixed. That'll be the big one for me. Uh, let's see here. It's about center, right? Yep, that is exactly center. Okay, so nice big windows like that, maybe? Do you think? Yeah, we think. And like this. And then where's the center here? Let's eyeball it. Is right about right about there. Is that the center? Yes, it is. So let's just close it off a bit. Close this off a bit. 
and like that, and like that. And there's two nice big windows again. Is this off center? No, it's right. It's right. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to just make nice big windows, and every floor is basically going to be like this, I think, because that looks good. Like that, that, and like that. All right. This hotel is actually <laughs> coming along very nicely. It's going to be that tall. Wow, that is tall. Okay, now I see a zombie. Let's go kill things with this boomstick. We haven't used this boomstick in a long time. Oh, face my wrath. Oh no, no, put it out, put it out. It's catching the grass, oh no. Don't burn my precious hotel. I was on, f what? Huh? Do, do, do you see this happening? I'm on fire, but not on fire. <laughs> Weird. Okay, let's just go set more things on fire. Ha, you missed. Oh, no. I set myself on fire for real that time. Crap. Crap. <laughs> this is the funnest thing I've ever experienced. Oh, you jerk. Ha. <gasps> oh, no. No, I am not ready for you, Creeper. Charged Creeper! Ha! Take that. Oh, the fun we can have in this mod when we try. But it would be great. You know what would be great? If the Anu armor, like what I am currently wearing, the helmet, uh, what do they call it? Ancient helmet? If the ancient armor, like say I had ancient chest plate, ancient leggings, ancient booties, if I would be resistant to fire. That only makes sense, doesn't it? Resistant to fire because he's from the nether? Maybe? I don't know. Just giving you some suggestions. <laughs> okay, so what are we going to do for doors here? Hmm. Not a whole lot we can do for doors. I like the open concept. You know, just welcoming, come on in, you know. Have a nice reception desk at the end, maybe. Let's see what that would look like. Maybe we should have, like, uh, like this, and like this, and then like that, and like that. Nice welcome reception desk. Let's put, we're dressing this place up a little bit. Put a nice crafting table. Where should I put it? I'll break this block and put it right in there. And then... Some of these. I want some of those. And I want... What do I want? What do I want? I want these as well. One, uh, two of these. Okay, so the trapdoor is for this idea, you know, staff only, right? Then this, uh, this can be blocked off, employees only past that point. So you walk in, there's the reception desk, it's looking nice. Uh, and I wanted a couple of these just laying down on there just to make it look kind of textured. Um, I don't know. Can I place? Can I place? Let's see. Can I break this if that's on there? I don't think so. No. <laughs> I wish, because that would have looked really good, actually. Hmm. Eh. There we go. So there's my little reception desk so far. I'm going to put like chairs and stuff for people to sit in. And then like a stairway. I don't know where the stairway is going to be. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe back over here somewhere. Maybe the stairway could be like a spiral stairway starting here and then going up. You know? So it would be like this. 
Oops. <laughs> like that. And then up. But now we're already up up at the top. Huh. Well, whatever. <laughs> It'll look something like that, maybe. Except with stairs, actual stairs, not with uh, the blocks like that. But there we go. But that blocks the window. I don't know. It's a work in progress. As you know, it's been several episodes before I even worked on the hotel. So still a work in progress. Okay, let's go see what we have for eggs today because a lot of dinosaurs have been dying. Someone suggested that I go and interrogate or investigate or interview all the all the witnesses trying to find who the suspect is. That's not a bad idea. Oops. I thought there would be something inside of this music player juki box. Um what am I looking for? I completely forgot. Oh yeah, right, I remember. Eggs. Look at all the eggs! Okay. So we got Pterosaur. That's Barry Allen. Triceratops, that would be like the new, I don't know, Mary slash Larry type. Uh, Stegosaurus, Dilophosaurus, 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 and a Plesiosaurus. I'm going to make these. Why? Because I want to see what they are like in this new updated version. I don't think I have. But I've heard that they are kind of glitching now too, where they don't uh, they don't do anything bad. Like they won't attack you. There's no fun in that. Uh, let's just break this here. Yeah, okay. We are going to place these down, place this down, place this down. Now, they can't be tamed, so I don't have to stick around. I'm just going to brick that up like that. And those guys will eventually hatch and become my Dilophosaurus. Hopefully they survive. There's nothing to drown them now. I took all the water out except for in the corners. And I think that I even sealed up the corners, maybe. Looks like I might have. I sealed it up there, and I sealed it up there, yeah. So they can't even get into that water in the corner. So there's nothing that can drown them. They should stay alive. They should stay alive. Now, one thing I wanted to do, because a lot of people were saying that what happened with the dinosaurs is that they got too old. But that's impossible. Larry's... I mean, they weren't even adults yet. <laughs> Let's see Larry here. He is an adult now. Finally. No! 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 Larry! No! Oh my god. No! What? No! You dumb guy! Stop trying to kill yourself. Mary will come back. Mary will come back. It's okay. It's okay. He's 13 days. He's got eight little health thingies. Oh no. Ah, don't kill yourself, Larry. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, these dinosaurs. I'm a nervous wreck with them around. Stop going into the corn. Why do you want to go into the corner? Move. Go away. No. I'm not moving until you move. Is it because... Is it because of the raptors that I can hear? No, couldn't be. Okay, well, you behave yourself, Larry. Behave yourself. I'll be watching you. Ugh. Larry is just gonna die in the wall. That's probably what's happening. Why are they dying like that? They shouldn't. Yeah! You heard me. Don't do it. These guys are still... Huh? A baby! Oh my god. Did you hear that? It's a T-Rex. But they had a baby! Look! 
That's the first time that I've ever seen them lay an egg in this version of the mod. I didn't even think it was possible. But there's a little baby running around. Mr. Mocking Cow, we have a baby. He doesn't care. <laughs> Don't mock the baby. Okay. That guy is still, still in the hole. Refuses to leave. Ah. Uh. Crap. Larry, why? Larry, why? This isn't the dinosaur mod if they all suffocate in the... <laughs> oh, no. Oh. If they're just dying in the walls, I mean, that's no fun. Fix it, guys. Fix it. Okay, well, we're going to put Larry to good use here. Oh, these guys are huge now. Huge. Well, they're about the same as they were before. <laughs> okay, this is how we put Larry to good use. There we go. They seem to be liking that. They seem to be eating. Can I ride one? No, you gotta tame them. You gotta tame them. And you gotta use a scarab gem to tame them, and it's just about impossible to get a scarab gem. So... We shall see. No! No! Get off my... No! Get down! Ah! Fighting with a T-Rex to get on the block? There we go. Alright, well, what I was going to do in this episode was build a hotel and also take down this dirt. So I guess that's what I'm doing next. Is just taking down the dirt while we listen to Tyrannosaurus party here working away doing what are they doing not a whole lot okay don't break the block out from under myself that would be bad but these guys are pushovers I know you guys say I'll get eaten but I just don't I don't see it these guys they seem okay to me they sure are active, though. You remember the first Tyrannosaurus that I ever had? Where it basically just stood in the corner and didn't move? These guys are so much more active. I love it. Of course, they don't have, like, a Triceratops. Who was using the door? Uh, anyway, they don't have a Triceratops right next door to them, so... It's a little bit better for them. A little bit better for their nerves. Okay. This is looking good, I think, so far. I also got to take down... I'm going to take down that middle piece. Um, if they start fighting each other, I'll just eventually build a wall in between them or something. And, I don't know. Maybe we'll have some kind of a Tyrannosaurus arena fight battle thing. <laughs> you never know. I'm excited about these guys, though. This is like... The pride and joy of this whole place. The raptors, yeah, they're cool. They're cool. I want to get different colored raptors as soon as I get some raptor eggs. But, oh, I've been waiting for Tyrannosauruses for so long. And finally I got two eggs, and both eggs hatched fine, and these guys seem to be doing fine. Oh, it's just great. So, a lot is going to be happening uh, pretty soon. I I haven't mentioned it yet, so I won't get into the details. Uh, it's coming up in another episode of my Red Cube series, where I kind of talk about my schedule and me working on stuff. But I guess I can tell you guys, because you guys are special. Uh, you get to hear it before I even post that episode. That... What? What? You want to hear it too? Okay. Listen up. Right now, we do dinosaur episodes on Tuesdays, and we do the dinosaur episodes on Thursdays, and that's really it. We do it Tuesdays, Thursdays, but I'm thinking about it. I know you guys want more. You always want more. Every day I hear, oop, 
Don't want to break that block. Nope, 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 bad. Redstone there. Hmm? Is there a cow using my doors? <laughs> cow. Watching the pigs. Sitting on the bench. Well, in enjoy, sir. Enjoy our park. Oh, anyway. You guys want more. I know you guys want more. It's very hard for me to make more. But I've been thinking about it. I've been thinking long and hard about it. And I'm going to be trying to do more dinosaur episodes in a week. I will be doing them Tuesdays and Thursdays. And I am going to try my hardest to also do them on Sundays. So you'll have three days in a week to watch. And that will give you probably enough to hopefully enjoy this as, as well as the other mods that I happen to be doing. Like my Pokemon and the Lion King and all those other great things. Don't you jump out of here. Don't you dare. Get, go away. Nope. 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 Bad, 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 bad. Ah. Ooh, they sure want to leave. I don't know why. But it's what they want. <laughs> I'm so glad I can work in this environment. It's like being a real zookeeper here. Except instead of, you know, dealing with lions and tigers and bears, you have to deal with giant reptilian creatures that will eat you in one shot. You are gone. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. I was afraid. I was terrified when I first saw these guys. How, how are they doing, by the way? They're four days old. Untamed, of course. Little peckish. This guy, too. I think he just grew a bit. Did they both just grow a bit? Let's see. Are they eating? I think they're eating a little bit. Maybe. It's hard to say. I'm pretty sure that had more meat in it before, but... Yeah. It's good. It's good. Now... These guys are noisy! Can't even concentrate on what I'm saying. I should have kept a piece of Larry there. Because I could have put him into the analyzer and gotten some DNA back. But... In the meantime, I'll just have to find another... I had another Triceratops. I'll make another Larry. That's all. It's very sad what happened there, but... Until this mod is basically fixed where they don't suffocate in the walls no you stupid crazy dumb stop it stop it <laughs> get away get away man oh he was totally climbing out totally climbing out <laughs> Wow. Okay, well, they are huge, though. Oh, I really wish I had... I do have torches. Okay, I'm going to drop down. Ugh. Place some torches. Just all, all around. I don't want anything bad happening to them. Okay, one there. Good. Good boy. Good boy. Now, the suggestion was made that I should cheat in the scarab gems because scarab gems I think have like a 1 in 10,000 chance of of appearing or something like that well I'm not gonna break 10,000 fossils there's just no way and that leads me to something that I gotta say about this mod and again if you're a developer watching this maybe this is something that you should take note of just just a, a tip Okay. We don't all cheat. We don't all have creative mode and we can't just randomly fly around all day looking for them. Some of us like to play legitimately. Right, Mr. Pig? Right. Where are the ships? Where are the sunken ships? Huh? It's a big endless ocean. 
I've traveled for miles. There are no sunken ships. If there are, they're so rare that <laughs> you might find one every 10,000 blocks. I don't know. That's too rare. What kind of mod makes it so hard to find the stuff in the mod that you'd almost think that you weren't playing a mod at all? That's not fun. You gotta make them more common. Make the ships more common. Weapon shops. Are you kidding me? Weapon shops? I found a few in my old world. Can't find any in here. As far as I know, one single weapon shop could spawn for an entire world. That's from the code itself what I saw when I compiled it myself. That's too rare. It's just crazy. Just crazy. Gotta make things like that more common. And Scarab Gems. One in 10,000 chances? And you have whole sets of Scarab Gem weapons and stuff? Make them more common. Make them as common as Diamond, even. I mean, what's wrong with that? It should be more common. That's all I'm saying. We want to play this mod. We want to have fun with this mod. And right now, the only way is if I cheat in the Scarab Gems. So, my question to everybody watching is, should I cheat in the Scarab Gems? Just give myself a handful of Scarab Gems. Say, oh, I don't know. Uh, I'd only give myself like 10. Maybe 20. <laughs> 20 Scarab Gems and call it a day. Now, I could do that. But I'd like it if the mod were fixed in a way that makes, the, makes it so that you don't have to cheat them in. So that you could just go digging, you know, branch mining, find some in some fossils. It would be great, wouldn't it? Uh, okay, so a name for this guy. I don't know, lots of people kind of weighed in on a name for him. And, of course, there's the names for the Tyrannosaurus. I'll get to that, too, I guess, in this episode. Um, now, of course, this guy's long neck, Bob Littlefoot. And this guy, I think I'm just going to call him... I mean, there was a lot of comments to call him, like, Littlefoot and that kind of thing. Littlefoot was an Apatosaurus. He wasn't a Brachiosaurus. That wouldn't be right, but that's what this guy's name is anyway. This guy's name? Simply be Junior. How's Junior doing? He's doing great! He's been eating, I think. How's this guy doing? How's this guy doing? Can't. Where's his click? There it is. He's been eating too, I think. He's getting quite big. Wow. Big guy. Still glitches when I look up. That's another thing that should be fixed. That's all. I'm just, I'm just weighing in because I know that things are being developed and a few of the developers watch this show. So, <laughs> all in due time. I know, I know. It's very, very difficult and time-consuming to program a mod like this, but I'm just giving some suggestions. Okay. So, on to the names of the T-Rex. The Tyrannosaurus Rexes. Well, I won't assume that they're Tyrannosaurus Rex. They're just Tyrannosaurus. Let's call them that. Okay. Now, one of them a male, one of them a female. <laughs> I like the comment, uh, you know, something to the effect of, like, stay absolutely still. Their sight is based on movement, you know, that basically the Jurassic Park thing. What I always got a kick out of was in the further books, like The Lost World and the movies, is what I mean, how they basically were like, his assumption was that their sight was based on movement, but he was wrong. <laughs> like, oh, good. That's something that they should have known, probably. Anyway. Names for them. Female and a male. I liked the names that I saw someone give. Uh, one of them being T-Bone. A lot of people actually said T-Bone for T-Rex. T-Bone T-Rex. And T-Betty. 
T Betty will be the other one. T Bone and T Betty. It's just perfect. It's just perfect names. You can't get more perfect. So those are their names. You got Long Neck Bob Littlefoot and Junior. And now we gotta get some new Triceratops and Stegosaurus and Oh the Dilophosaurus! I bet they're done now. Let's just run down uh go the long way I guess because I don't want to hurt myself. And then we will end this episode on that note. Hey! Sticking your head out. This guy taking a drink? Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Where are they? Oh, look at them! Little babies! I'm gonna go say hello. Shall we? They're gonna get out. They're just gonna escape everywhere. This is gonna be a disaster. Hey, little baby guys! Wow! There's the third. Cool! Little Dilophosaur babies. You know, in the code, I think they're called Uteraptors. Yeah, probably more more fitting, but whatever. Eh, I'm in the water. There we go. Have fun, little guys. Grow big, grow strong. Oh, crap. I gotta put food, a feeder in there. A fooder. I gotta put a fooder in there for these guys to feed. Eventually, I'm gonna I have to make one. And I have to get some meat somehow. And we will see you guys next time. Actually, let's go. Let's leave this episode watching these guys grow. See ya. Bye-bye.